Do you want that? It's so tall. How are you gonna touch it? <laughs> Touched it. Then you gotta get it. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back. Alexandria and Daisy here. Say hi. Say hi, Daisy. I just got back from vacation and it turns out while I was in Cali for a week it was Stacy's birthday while I was gone and I feel like the worst dog mom. I feel so bad because I don't know if you guys have seen my birthday videos for Daisy but if you haven't check them out. I literally go all out. She has her little dog friends come over and I make them cupcakes that are dog friendly and we just really have like a real party. So I feel really bad and I thought it would be fun to go shopping with her because it's been so long since we've been shopping in general, but especially Petco or PetSmart shopping. I'm really late to this trend, but I thought it would be fun to do the video where it's you buy everything your dog touches at the pet store. So obviously Daisy's really small, she can hardly like reach anything. So if I see something cute, she might just have to touch it. I am so tired you guys. I actually just woke up from a nap. Like I put my makeup on this morning and I was tired and I took a nap because of my whole like schedule and then Cali time is different than Texas time and I've just been exhausted. So I'm gonna make this little yummy coffee smoothie thing. What I'm gonna use is some ice. So I just have it in my blender already. Um, I am also going to use a protein powder. So this one is specifically from Teamy, and I really love this one because I'm not vegan, but this is a vegan product, but I am non-dairy, so it's super perfect for people that are lactose intolerant like myself or people that are just more plant-based, and it tastes really good. Like, honestly, I love the way it tastes. It's not chalky, and you can actually bake with it too. So I've been really loving this stuff. I had another recipe on my last video of another little smoothie that I make with this. It's like bananas and spinach and almond milk and this. It's so good. So I just love little smoothies with protein because it's just like an easy way to, you know, get your craving in of chocolate but in a healthy way. So I love this one. So we're going to use that. And then I'm going to use this Truvia because I like mine sweet. And I don't like to have a lot of sugar. So this is like plant sugar. So if you're someone that doesn't do well with like refined products or if you're just trying to not have as much sugar, like I think it's called keto. Um, I could be wrong and just be completely stupid sounding right now. But I really have been enjoying these little individual packets because it helps me like maintain the right amount of servings and I just I try to keep really low on like artificial sugar so or even real sugar so this plant sugar is like really good a uh, completely brewed coffee already and it's cooled off so it's not gonna melt my ice up all instantly I'm just going to put it into one of my little tumbler cups. So I'm just going to fill the rest up with ice, actually. So I want it to stay cold. It honestly, like, reminds me of a Starbucks drink, but um, I feel like if I used almond milk, it would be even better. But like I said, I just got back from vacation, and I need to go work shopping. Now that I have my little drink ready, I'm going to get Daisy ready. She's over here sleeping. Do you want to go shopping, Daisy? Let's go. Come on. Let's go. <laughs> you want to go shopping? Yes. Stretch. Yeah, wake it up. Wake it up. You need a puppuccino? No? Okay. Yeah. You already got energy, huh? I feel like I forgot how to vlog, but here's my outfit of the day. It's this cute little sweatsuit from Fashion Nova. My Adidas, and I love these things. They're so cute. And Daisy to match. She's wearing her cute little harness. This is a harness. It is not a dress. It is a harness for everyone that always says it's a dress. And I have this cute little retractable leash. And you are just the cutest, Daisy. Everybody loves your outfit. And then, of course, my bag and 
we are ready to go. I definitely need to get some more little like poopy bags because I always tie one around my leash thing, but I'm so tired of doing that. So I think we're gonna get some new ones today. And just gotta get this and we're ready to go. Oh, and my keys, we definitely need those. Daisy. And we're out. Let's go. It is 97. Oh yes, we're enjoying the AC here. So I'm in like the back of the store and Daisy's scared to be here. Like she was going for the exit earlier and so I had to pick her up before she like went out of the store. Daisy, what's wrong? I think it's just been so long since she's been at a store and then there's like people and there's actually a lot of dogs here. There's like at least four dogs I've already seen. And so I think she's just scared so so bad and plus they don't even have a lot of cute stuff so that also makes me sad i want her to feel uncomfortable i know this is like dramatic like oh my god my dog is uncomfortable but it's my child and if daisy doesn't like it i don't like it either so we already need a little doggy bag so boop daisy touched it we gotta get it now um food there's always so many different choices but look at these yummy little meals that kind of looks like Pomeranian maybe it's a hairy chihuahua I don't know but ooh that looks yummy Daisy do you like that do you want that it's so tall how are you gonna touch it oh. touched it then you gotta get it <laughs> I forgot remember to wear your masks guys Stay safe. Let me get Daisy a mask. <laughs> hey Daisy, what's that? Did you touch it? <gasps> you touched it? Okay. back in the car and Daisy's feeling much better now I think she was just so nervous because there was other dogs and she hasn't been to the store in a while so we're gonna go to Petco and see what they have to offer Petco excited okay we're in Petco there's like no one here which is great Piggies. Look at how cute their clothes are. Little mermaid shark. They're so cute. Mm. Uh, this harness is like a little mermaid. <laughs> so cute. <gasps> oh my goodness. What are you looking at? It's birthday themed. <gasps> Daisy. Oh my god, this stuff is so cute. <gasps> oh, this is adorable. Little hats. And this is just the cutest little birthday dress. I love it. <laughs> oh, you want that? Ooh, you want those? Okay. Crunchy clovers, wholehearted. We're gonna get some. 
Ooh, something caught her attention. Mmm. Those are kind of big for you. Oh, you want those? You want these? We'll get them for you. She already has these, but I guess she likes them. You want that one? This one too? What about this? Okay. So we're home and I am so hungry so, because it's been a while since I had my little smoothie and I'm definitely hungry for something more now. So I want to show you what I made just because I know you guys like when I show you what I eat. What I made is Italian sub sandwiches. So what I did was I took a hot dog bun and I put butter, um, garlic powder, and oregano on the bottom and then I put turkey and I put marinara sauce and then I just topped it with a tiny bit of oregano. Sorry, that one looks kind of weird. It's not the most aesthetic thing, but oof, I love, mm, I love this stuff. It's so yummy. It's just like super random stuff. I just put it together and voila, we have a recipe. And Daisy, it's not gonna get any, I'm sorry. We got you one of treats though. Mm, 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 mm. So the first thing that she got was this Wellness Core grain-free mini meals for small breeds. This one's shredded chicken and lamb, entree and gravy. This is going to be your little meal. Mm-hmm. And then she got little bakery crispies. These are 100% real food banana and bacon recipe, light and handy snack size treats. And it's really light, but... It says it's got ingredients of oats, rice, bananas, beet powder, natural bacon flavor, and citric acid. So, and seems to be healthy. Like I told you guys, I love to look at the ingredients. Now, I didn't look at the ingredients of this, but the first ingredient is chicken. So, I always try and make sure that the first ingredient is chicken or like, you know, something good. Hey, you want to try one? We're going to sit all the way over there. Come sit by, right beside me, honey. Okay, so they're like little balls. They look like little cheat uh, cocoa cups. <laughs> you wanna try it? Yeah, look at them. They look like cocoa puffs. Okay. I don't know if y'all have seen that TikTok where the girl opens these crackers and she pulls so hard and then they just go everywhere, but I always feel like that's gonna happen to me. I'm not weak. Ooh. It did happen, crap. Wow, it did happen. Wow, I jinxed it, I practically jinxed it. They're literally all over my lap. Wow, love that. She's eating them off me. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna clean that up real quick before I have treats all over the place. She had her treat, so. Let's finish up showing them what we got. So I also picked up these little poopy bags you guys saw. One of them is like little balloon animals. One's pink and one's blue and I thought those were super cute. Like I said, I've been tying little doggy bags along the end of my leash, but I'd rather not do that because I just love the aesthetic and having this on there and I feel like the pink and the blue and everything would just look super cute together and aesthetic is life so that's what we got from pet smart where she was like super weirded out and what we got from petco is even cuter you guys know I don't care if Daisy touched it or not but she had to get this harness because it is so classy and super cute. It's got pearls and this cream lace all over and little tutu at the bottom. So here's what it looks like on her. I still haven't taken the tag off yet, but it's so cute. It looks so cute on her. Daisy, what do you think? What do you think? I think it's super pretty. Very fit for a princess. 
So she picked out these wholehearted soft and chewy training treats for dogs peanut butter recipe. Mmm, and they're soft for sure. So we're gonna go ahead and try one of these too. So I could not open it, save my life. So we're just gonna cut through it. See, that's fine too. Oh. oh, they don't smell like peanut butter. What do we think? She likes to go sit on the carpet and eat. So, if you're done eating the treat, what would you rate it? Five stars? Paul? Yeah. Okay. So she also got some greenies, and these are the teeny ones. She has greenies and she actually really likes them. I can't tell you if they make a difference in her breath or not, but it fights plaque and tartar and it's recommended for dental care. So we're gonna go with it. By the way, I don't even know what it's made of, but it's made of wheat flour, glycerin, wheat gluten, gelatin, water, pallid cellulose. Okay, to be honest, that sounds disgusting. Daisy, why'd you pick these? I don't know. Hmm. I don't know how I feel about it after reading that, but on to the next. If y'all have any information about greenies and like if they're actually healthy, let me know. Let a girl know. Um, and then she wanted to pick out this huge bone because it's like the only things on the bottom. And I went ahead and substituted it for something realistic that she can enjoy. This is a rabbit roll sausage and it's from Argentina. Ooh. So it's rabbit, cornstarch, vegetable glycerin. They look super like yummy. Like she's going to love this. And the last thing we picked up, she got a um, Merrick's Fresh Kisses, cleans teeth and freshens breath. It's a double brush infused with coconut and botanical oils. It's like a tiny little toothbrush. Almost. So that's the last thing that we got. I'm gonna give her one of these little rolls. But I really miss Daisy on my trip and I feel bad that I missed her birthday, but y'all know I'm gonna make it up and I'm gonna have a great birthday party. Whoa, okay. I'm gonna break it in half. I don't wanna give it to her yet because I want her to stay for the outro. But I hope you guys really enjoyed this video and found some cute stuff. I know it's crazy because of this whole thing going on, but like you can still find cute stuff. I think maybe we'll do an Amazon haul next time because you can find more things online than you can in stores. Plus it's safer to shop online. I had so much fun going out and shopping again with Daisy, even though she got really scared at the first place. I think that it's good to keep them socialized, but I think it's just really good to like understand your dog and know whenever they're like scared or like not comfortable and then like make a decision based off of that. So I love my Daisy so much and I just pay attention to how she acts and I don't ever want her to be scared or uncomfortable when we're trying to have fun and I'm not going to do it just for the video so I'm glad that she felt better at the next place because there was like literally no one hardly in there. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and yeah that's it. I'm going to give you a treat. Go eat it. Go have fun. I love you guys. I'll see you in my next one. Bye.